So Audio Technica suck. Well, kinda. Check this out. So I'm an artist, of course. Some of y'all know me, I'm an independent artist. I go by the name Lil Passion and I've put out music about 10 plus years. I wanna show you guys the equipment that I use. Stay tuned in the video so you guys can know exactly what I mean when I say that Audio Technica suck. But you know I'm gonna get it cause I'm trying to be the realest and the one you really feeling when you're looking at ceiling and you know I'm all up in it so you're stressing at me. First off, I do want to say that the Audio Technica is pretty dope. It comes with three different cables. One line cable is like a slinky kinda, which is this and some very solid cables a short one and a longer one it also comes with an adapter which is actually pretty cool and it's nice because sometimes when you have an interface this is perfect some of you have probably seen it in music videos a lot of your favorite artists probably use the auto technicas they have a funny looking cool design they have this design right there so I'm not sponsored by it, okay? I'm gonna give you the realest review that I can say. These headphones, I've been using them for quite some time. I released a lot of singles with these headphones and to be honest, I'm really happy and satisfied with it. I would say I've released, I was actually doing the numbers not too long ago, I've released about 50 plus songs just with these headphones alone. Before that, I want to say I was using just some regular earplugs. The more you know, the, the better you learn. I know a lot of people wanna go with some maybe like Beats. I like to go with Audio Technicas because they are specifically made for studio. They focus on the studio enhancement. Personally, I've never had any, any problems with it whatsoever. I'm pretty happy with them. They come in different colors. I have currently, because I like them, I got two of them the same. They're just black, black and blue, which these are obviously one of the nicest ones so now to the get to the nitty-gritty okay this is why i was saying that they suck everything is great the sound is amazing for me i can hear the bass i can hear the clarity on the vocals especially when you're mixing when you're mastering it is by far to me the best everybody has their different opinions so hey respects i'm telling you from independent artist's point of view been making music for a minute this is what i love the only only downfall that i feel like it's not it's not a big deal all right, I'm gonna just put it out. It's not a big deal. But to me, kind of sucks a little bit. Check this out. Perfect, right? They look dope. Look what's happening right there. That is probably one of the biggest downfalls. And let me show you another one that's worse. These ones. Look at that. I'm looking into getting a cover. I think you can get an Amazon. But even look at the paddings. They're not a big deal. It's not really a big deal because you can get some of these smooth like a nice polished cut look at that these patterns right here i got them on amazon and honestly they weren't that bad if you want to change the padding you can which is actually nice the only thing that's going to be a little difficult is just putting a cover over this which i'm already looking into that's pretty much the only downfall honestly i'm really happy with these if you're an independent artist out there i'm going to be completely honest with you i recommend these i really recommend these i've been happy with them never had to just switch these i've had longer obviously you can tell these i just got like a few years ago not to i'd say like maybe two I'd say like about three years ago these i've had the longest look at them they're still going man they're still strong and they do their job at the end of the day it's not what you have it's what you can utilize for yourself honestly to be real with you don't sweat it man eventually you'll get to the point where you'll be able to afford and get some pretty nice gear you don't have to get all that mixer stuff and it, people i think sometimes overdo it some people just like it you know that's that's their hobby and much respect to that but me i keep it simple the simplistic as ever if you guys are interested in that i'm gonna be posting more videos about it of the equipment that i use the equipment i've used in the past drop in the comments anything that you guys want to know on what i do what i use i'll be happy to answer it don't forget to subscribe it's your boy passion y'all better know what's good that's right